This is terrible. I'm ripping it up. They're like mushroom coffee and mushroom drinks. We do. Oh no. A tiger's life. It's a comic. <laughs> Ooh, more stickers. Kind of cute. Hi everyone. Thank you so much for being here. This is not going to be a talking video today. I'm actually going to be taking you guys on a trip with me to make an advent calendar for Alexis. You know her. If you don't know her, if you're new here, my name is Michi. I'm a fourth year PhD student at the University of Hawaii at Manoa and Alexis, my partner, is also a fourth year PhD student now, also at the University of Hawaii. And I'm from Germany and in Germany it's super common to make advent calendars for the people that are important to you in your life. Usually when you grow up, your parents make one for you. And I'm not talking those little chocolates behind the doors. We make advent calendars that are little gifts for each day in December that's leading up to Christmas. So there's gonna be 24 things to open. And yeah, we do that for our partners, for our parents, for our sisters. I've never made one for my sister. But yeah, people that we care about. I have made one for Alexis every year since I've known her, I think. I think. And I think she's gonna make one for me, so I'm gonna try really hard to make this one a good one. And I'm actually filming it while she's at school still. So I only have about three hours or something today to get all of it set up. It's obviously not gonna work out because I ordered stuff late on Amazon and in Hawaii things don't get here fast. Actually, I don't even know if they're gonna get here before the 1st of December, but let me show you guys what I've been up to. How do you see my orders? Arriving December 5th. Perfect. It's not even shipped yet. I can't believe it. I purchased it November 14th, you can see. So I got these bags for her that I'm going to put on a string and I want to put it right above our bed. I'll show you. So this is our bed in our tiny, um, tiny studio and I want to put up the bags right up there. So yeah, now I just need 24 things to put into there. And usually those things don't have to be or shouldn't be super expensive because it's, you know, one thing that you open a day. So it's usually just tiny things. My mom used to put like little erasers or chocolates, candies, things like that. So one thing that I ordered and it's actually the only thing that already got here is this. I looked up where to find free stickers online and one of them was, I don't know how you pronounce it, PETA? You know, the animal organization, animal rights organization. And it's actually PETA Kids. So the kids version of it. So let's see what we got. You didn't have to pay for anything, not even shipping, because I think they're just using it as advertising. Because if I like the stickers and I put them on, this is terrible how I'm ripping it up. Oh, oh, ah, wow, so many. Maybe that's not the best thing to put in there. Vegan power and speciesism. Speciesism. I kind of like these, kind of cute. And then what do we have here? Free poster and stickers. Those are probably the stickers already. Let animals be free. Help Leo leave the circus. It could be nice for like some stress relief. A tiger's life. It's a comic. <laughs> Ooh, more stickers. I don't want to rip it. Empathy for all large and small. I can probably put these in one or two. One or two different bags if I had bags. This goes in the trash. So let's see what else there is. If it comes here on time, I ordered these bars. I think they're low sugar and they have some brain nutrients. Yeah. They have lion's mane, the mushrooms in it. And Alexis definitely likes those focused mushrooms. So hopefully I can put some of those in there. And there are a lot in this, so I'll put them into different, different bags. And yeah, I guess now I should probably get going to the store to get some other small things. And you can come with me. Let's go. First, I'm gonna go to the store called Down to Earth. Um, it's kind of it's a chain grocery store in hawaii so and like health food stuff so hopefully i can find some good deals there i think i don't want to spend more than like i don't know two dollars for each 
Some of them can be a little bit more expensive, but most of them should be pretty cheap. We'll see if I can find small things or things that I can break up into different ones. Let's take a bag so that I don't have to buy a bag in the store. Outside in the store, there's two things that are below two dollars, but there's actually H Mart right by down to earth. So I'll go see if I can find something there. Okay, so I wasn't super successful when I went to Down to Earth and H Mart, but I got some stuff and let me show you a little bit faster this time. Um, I got one recovery drink from H Mart uh, for our marathon. So I'm gonna put it into one of the bags that's close to the marathon. Then we have these two candies that I got from Down to Earth and it was really fun because I got to pick my own bag I got to pick these things to close it. I had to like use a little shovel to put it in the bag. I got to put my own sticker, but this one's crystallized ginger. I hope it tastes good. It has lots of sugar on it. So hopefully that'll make it taste good. And then this is chunks of energy, carob spirulina. Hopefully these are good. I got these soaps. Um, this one's Ayurvedic soap. So it has some natural herbs from India. Hopefully Alexis is gonna like that. And then I have this ancient clay soap with peppermint oil. Um, this one was only 99 cents. I hope she's gonna like both of these. I got mango chili. This one was actually super expensive. It was $6.56 for this little box. But Alexis loves mango chili and usually they're not the best because of the red dyes in it um, But this one is a healthy version. So I thought it's worth paying more for it They gave me this one for free. Actually. I was looking at it. It was like supposed to be 50 cents or something They gave it to me for free. Um, I got this dark chocolate. We love dark chocolate and maybe that's it at down-to-earth and then at H Mart I got rice noodles they only have rice flour and water we love these and we don't buy them too often because we usually go to costco so hopefully she's gonna like it i have to put it somewhere else or somehow i don't know give it to her because it won't fit in the bags and i have this ear cleaner i found it also at h mart and then the last thing i got for her from h mart is this curry golden curry so with the stickers and the book, and I think I'm just going to give it all to her in one, for one day. This is going to be one day, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I have twelve things. Yeah, I have twelve things so far, so I'm missing twelve more, right? I'm missing 12 more things. Okay, now I'm also gonna, let me show you. Now I'm gonna make the little cards that have the numbers on it so that I can put it onto the bag. And I'm also gonna write some gift cards or yeah, is that what it's called? Just a little card that says, today you get one donut for me. I saw some things at Down to Earth that were cool, but they were fresh. So I didn't want to get them now and, and them go bad. So I'm just gonna put the gift card in it and then we can go get it together. So let's make these or the numbers first. Maybe green, red, and yellow. No, only green and red. Ok, 
Okay, so that makes two more. And now I kind of have to get going already because I have to pick up Alexis again. So I kind of have to make this disappear. I think I have to finish this another time. Maybe I'll go to Ross. I got lots of stuff at Ross last year. They had some good things. And I also had one other idea that I need to do on campus. I'll take you guys with me if I end up doing it. Okay, so for now, the bag is gonna go there. Alexis can't look into this. Yeah, sorry about the bad lighting, but I'm here at our dog sitting place, so I also can't show much around me, but um, Alexis is just walking the dogs and I am working on one of the bags for our advent calendar. Okay, I just worked super long on making the sticker design and I actually didn't this is Alexis's handwriting and she never wrote this so I had to make it out of these letters the O is actually the A <laughs> and the one is actually an L but hopefully it doesn't come out too bad when it's printed hopefully you can't see that that's it but yeah I made this sticker and I tried so many versions and I also wanted to make one with this design which is our regular podcast cover art. But I'm not sure if I like it that much. I think if I want to print them on campus, it's only $7 for 100 pieces. So I'm just gonna give it a try, I think. Okay, so after some hiccups, I finally have time to go print the stickers. I'm on campus now and Alexis is sick today. So that's why I can go print the stickers now. But because we have a carpool pass for parking on campus, they make me pay because we're not two people in the car. Can you believe that? We even have a parking pass, they make me pay just because Alexis is sick. What am I supposed to do? Bring her with a fever? But yeah. Okay, so this took a long time to get ready. Guys, it's November 26th. I finally got the advent calendar or the little bags. So this is when I'm continuing my video. I'm gonna show you guys what we got and then we're gonna finally get everything up. It's kind of way too late. I wanted to get it done earlier, but let's see. And you can see I got these bars that I wanted. I also got these two things at, when I was at Whole Foods the other day, actually. They're like mushroom coffee and mushroom drinks for energy and immunity support. When I was printing the stickers, or actually, I didn't even tell you guys that I didn't get to print the stickers yet because I had to send them online. But when I was there, I got this sticker for free. So I'm also gonna put it in the advent calendar and hopefully they're gonna send me an email soon that the stickers are printed and that I can pick them up because there's not too much time left. And now I have these bags. this cord or oh and something like emergency it was a few cents like 70 cents or something at Whole Foods So it's supposed to be 50 pieces. Yeah, they're kind of a nice size. Muslin bags. I don't even know what that is. Okay, and then they're gonna have these things in it. So let's say this one. Oh no, can you see through? A little bit. Well, hopefully not when it's against the wall. Wow. I've gotten them before, these bars. But I think maybe they updated their packaging because it looks fancy now. Different one. That one was blueberry. This one's banana nut. And they come, they have, um, oh, I already told you guys. They have lion's mane. And now I need to get what I prepared last time I was here, which was probably a week ago already. Let me show you guys. So we had the numbers that I somehow need to glue on top.
I'm done. Even though when I was just cutting it, I was cutting the 19 next to the 21. So I'm wondering if I forgot number 20. We'll see. Now let me get some glue. Or this will do. Okay, so now I'm gonna somehow get the numbers onto the bags. Oh, this one has to be when I'm still here in Hawaii with Alexis because I'm gonna leave to go home to Germany. Oh no, it's so see-through. Take some of the early numbers. What day is our marathon again? That was number seven. Uh, maybe it's the 10th? Free donut on the 9th. Now I also need to put these things in. This mushroom coffee needs to be a day where she needs to focus. So when we still have school, maybe for our final, it might be the 11th? No, it might be the 16th? Maybe the 15th. I already have the 15th. Ah, oh, that's also good. It has an IQ bar. Then 14, 13 maybe. Guys, now that we're house sitting, and living in Kailua and Kaneohe. Well, only during house sitting. We didn't move, but I forgot how loud it is in town. Okay, so this one has to be maybe our last big run that we do. Oh no. I think we were thinking of doing that the fifth and the Sunday, the second. I don't have the second anymore. I don't have the fifth anymore either. I'll do it on the 4th, so she can keep it for the day after. Do you guys like how I expected it to fit? Good enough. Ear cleaner can be on Christmas. Did I miscount or did I not write enough numbers? these stickers. She doesn't want soap on marathon day. Maybe this isn't the best for marathon day either because it doesn't have any carbs. So maybe I won't give her these because they're maybe a little bit weird. I don't know. Oh, I forgot the stickers. I need to leave one for the stickers. The stickers will be in number six because number six has to be a big one because it's St. Nicholas Day. 
Hopefully they'll get there by the 6th. So for now I'll leave it empty. And then I only have two more. I kind of want to put this somehow, but how? For the one that I forgot, I still have to put the number. And this is marathon day. Okay, so I'm trying to put all of them in order on the bed to see if I'm missing some. Let's see, number two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 18 and 19 go, 17, 18, 19. Huh, that's all? I'm missing a few. What the heck was I doing? Guys, guess where I found number 21? In the trash. I took it right out of the trash. So I did end up putting one. It has an IQ bar and one of the stickers. And then I ended up writing these for the first one. It says, I love you so much. And I had a good time picking things out. And this one says, happy December 1st. Ask me about your first gift. And then I'm gonna give her this. So let's put this in the last one. Okay, so now the idea was to put up the bags with this thread or whatever it is on the wall. Right here, right there, above our bed. I don't know how that's gonna work out. Oh no, it's not going well. done it can't get nicer than this unfortunately maybe next time i'll try a little bit better but it's kind of cute i also added some lights look wow you can't see him yet it's not dark enough but i just told alexis to come home there are four of them right here because they were too heavy for this it kept coming down but it came out kind of cute one oh two three four oh four isn't there well i don't know how long it's gonna hold up but hopefully until alexa sees it for the first time oh man i thought it would come out better but let's wait and see what alexa says when she comes home it looked prettier in my head well let's see where she is i said you can come home Your call has been forwarded to voice. This girl never hears her phone. Hi. Hi, you can come home. Okay, I'll come now. Okay. See you soon. She's coming. She likes it. I love it. It's so cute. I've never had one that was on the wall. Where's yours gonna go? That one? It came out good. It's cute. I love the bags. Guys, my stickers are ready. It's Tuesday of the next week, but my stickers are finally ready, so I'm gonna go pick them up. Thank you guys so much for watching this video all the way to the end. I really appreciate I really appreciate you guys being here, you guys watching this. I hope you got some ideas for your own advent calendars or you just enjoyed seeing me make the one for Alexis. Maybe you wanna make something for someone that you care about next year and this gave you some inspiration. Actually, in the comments, do you mind not putting anything too specific about the advent calendar? because I'm gonna tell Alexis to not watch this video until until the end of the advent calendar, so until Christmas. So if you don't mind not mentioning what's in it in the comments, I would be super grateful. 
um, because she can see the comments when, she, when they come in because it's both of our account. But yeah, that's it. If you guys like this video, please give it a like. If you want to see more videos just about our life as PhD student at the University of Hawaii or just about our life in Hawaii or just about our life as a couple, you should subscribe. Please, please do. If you think you might like any other videos of ours, that's it. That's all I have for today. I'll see you guys in the next video. Happy holidays. Okay, so I think I just noticed that I told you this whole story without my microphone being on. Well, I wanna cry.